Working Mother Media CEO, Carol Evans. Carol Evans is the CEO of Working Mother Magazine. Joining us now is Carol Evans, CEO of Working Mother Media. Good morning, Carol. Should we applaud women for having ambition and wanting to have it all? Yes, 66% of Working Mother readers told us that they feel very ambitious or ambitious about their careers, and we applaud that. Flex time is much more important to working mothers than a $5,000 raise, because that's how they live their life, and that's how they make it work for their families as well as their career. You can't pay for that kind of flexibility. Do you do uh, any list of the worst 10? Well, we know who they are, but we don't do them. <laughs> now we're advocating for paid maternity leave and to make sure that companies really treat moms so well because the, America needs working mother's labor. And, and you say we've come so far, but where are we still seem to be stuck? Oh, we're stuck on a lot of things. We don't have paid maternity leave in our FMLA programs. And companies, we have 100 best companies, but all other companies are doing so much worse than the best. They need to step up. This has not been a policy instituted by big companies yet, but where employers are really trying to satisfy specific employees, and this, they know that this is what they want, they get the buy-in from a small group of employer, employees who are around the baby and really enjoy it. If the employees don't like it, I'm sure these things won't last. And what about clients? How do they look upon this? Well, you know, clients have gotten to be really good about this because clients are understanding that their best uh, people who are working on their accounts may be walking out the door because of having a baby. They don't want to lose the employees at the company that they care about. The women take the responsibility for the house and the kids, even when they're the sole breadwinner. So there's the stress of the home and there's tremendous stress on her when she realizes that she doesn't have choice anymore. She used to think she had choice. Now, now she's she does it. And yes. following up on what you just said, a recent study showed that when men became unemployed, the amount of time they devote to childcare does not increase. Women, just get out there, tell your husband what you need. It's not a time to really ask for help. It's time to say, here's the work that needs to be done. Let's divide it up. And then one little clue. Do not nitpick them right. about how they do the work. Let them take control. It's all about women giving them the opportunity to be a parent their way and to clean the house their way, right. if they will. Cheer them on. <laughs> don't, don't expect them to meet up to your expectations. Today, uh, many of our readers tell us that even if they're taking a significant career break, they still think of themselves as working women. You are all extraordinary women in this room. And let me just ask another question. How many of you have teenagers? Okay, definitely extraordinary women. We hold up the family. We hold up the community. And we are more and more holding up the American businesses. And it's spreading all around the globe.